121 new COVID-19 cases in Hawaii today. 49 of those come on Oahu, 51 on the Big Island, 16 on Lanai, 2 on Maui, 1 on Kauai, and 2 residents diagnosed out of state. The statewide total since the start of the pandemic is now 14,672. Nearly 3,000 cases remain active. For the first time since the start of the pandemic, a neighbor island surpassed Oahu's daily case numbers. Hawaii Island and Lanai are both dealing with a surge in cases, with the Pineapple Isle heading towards a stay-at-home order this week. Nikki Shenfeld gives us an update. Lanai is still waiting on the final word from Governor Ige on whether a stay-at-home order will go into effect on Tuesday. Doctors on island say about half the population has been tested, and officials are encouraging everyone to shelter in place. 78 cases have been reported on Lanai in less than a week. The small island has a population of about 3,000 with very little health care facilities. There's still a lot of worry and concern. He says Lanai has 13 hospital beds. 10 are currently occupied by long-term nursing home patients. There is no operating room, one ventilator, and one ER doctor. He says the majority of people tested were asymptomatic or mildly symptomatic. But the concern is if people start to require hospitalization. We do have some people that are positive who are elderly, who have some comorbidities, and who are at risk to get uh, sick and to get sick fast. Dr. Janikowski says the rapid spike in the numbers was due to the tight-knit community acting quickly and stepping up to get tested. People were cooperating and telling us who to check. He and officials are encouraging everyone on the island to get tested. The other issue you're looking at is people are concerned about their jobs. How do we get paid? You know, we don't get paid staying home. If everybody tests and probably another round of testing will come back again in the next few days. You know, we, we can beat this if we work together. Hawaii Island also saw a spike in cases on Sunday. It's really quite uh, stunning to see the number on Big Island actually being larger than the number on Oahu. There's mostly community spread. It's in different patches all across the island. And there's some additional cases in Ocean View uh, where some of the Pacific Islander community is getting hit pretty hard. He's been told most are from small family gatherings, but says more people need to wear masks. As for Lanai, he expects cases to increase over 100 in the coming days. And he asks that people not leave the island. Even though the lockdown's not coming until Tuesday, we, we really need people to stay home and isolate until we figure out exactly where the cases are. Dr. Janikowski's wife says donations have been pouring in statewide, but going from zero to almost 80 cases in under a week is a warning to all. It absolutely demonstrates how strong this virus is and how quickly and rapidly it can spread. Absolutely. Nikki Schoenfeld, KH12 News, working for Hawaii.